I could really go for some popcorn, Mal. Really? Yeah. Oh, man. Mm, that does sound kind of good. Let's get some popcorn, Tony. Oh, wow. I, I was I was about to say our names again, but look, we just cleverly said our names in the intro. Uh -huh. <laughs> popcorn! Popcorn! Ugh. He looks busy. I give up. Time to walk away. Hey, Grandpa! Give us popcorn or else! <laughs> Min is so brave. Then you better pay up. These are ten dollars a bucket. Damn. Ten dollars? What a ripoff. <laughs> Min hit the man in the groin with her bat. Oh my god. God damn. Oh no. Fuck. Oof. The man sinks to the ground as if he's been shot. Min grabs a popcorn bucket out of his tray. Oh my god. I got it. Let's go! Oh god! Let's take a final look, look at the at popcorn. popcorn guy. He's still curled up in pain. We better go before he recovers and comes after us. I feel so bad. I know. Walk back to seats. Oh, it's my dad. Yuck. Min's dad is really mad at her for cutting her hair like that. He's speaking Korean on the phone. I wonder what he's talking about. Min only taught me one through four so far. Dia must have been frowning without knowing it, because Min speaks up. Do you want to learn more? Hmm? Sure. How do you say hi in Korean? Hi? Easy. It's... Uh... Annyeong. Mm, oh. <laughs> Does she not know how to say it? Oh. Uh, Annyeong. Oh, I, okay. I'm, oh, wait. That might be a different... Uh... <laughs> Sarong, eh? Mal, are you also monolingual? I am mono. Well, I mean, I know a good chunk of German, but oh, yeah, okay. I'm monolingual basically. Oh, okay. I, I, yep. Yep. <laughs> Words? Y yep. Yeah. Well, uh, yeah. We did it! Mm -hmm. Look at us speaking Korean! <laughs> Min is staring at Dio with a really complicated expression on her face. What? Am I saying it right? Y yeah, that was good. Cool. Now I can greet you and Jun Seo like this. No, no, wait. You can't say that to Jun. <laughs> huh. Why not? Because, uh, it's a uh, special kind of uh -huh. pillow. Okay. You can only say it to certain people. Like me. Oh. Is it one of those things where if you use the wrong one, it's really bad? Y yeah, something like that. <laughs> it's tough to explain. <laughs> mm -hmm. But it's correct when I say it to you. Yeah. So only say it to me. Got it? Got it. <laughs> I like Min's, like, face whenever she's got that sort of, like, self-satisfied slash maybe nervous uh -huh. look. Uh-huh. Wow. Korean is really complicated. What about you? How do you say hi? Um. <laughs> teach her hi or teach her I like to fart. <laughs> oh, no. Because <laughs> you know she just taught us some bullshit. Um... Okay, well, we're, we're gonna, oh no, we're gonna say hi. I think that's more in character. Okay. Hi. Hi? Hi. Well, I mean, you know, assume that we're speaking this language properly. Uh-huh. Hi. Hindu? I don't know. I can't make out what they're saying. Oh, my dog. Oh, wait, no, they don't have a dog. They don't have a dog. I hope they're not saying bad stuff about me. He's still talking on the phone. Doesn't sound like he's using the phrase Min just taught me. I guess there's not a lot of opportunities to say hi in the middle of a conversation. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's hurry up and sit down. Junsio is probably wondering where we are. She's right. Poor Junsio. All right. <gasps> there you. Wait, hold on. <laughs> there you guys are. Where do you guys go? The dog. Dia, that's. Really cryptic. Is it? Here, take this. Min gives Dia the popcorn bucket. <gasps> Min, where'd you get that bat? Please don't tell me you did something bad. <laughs> yeah, it was fun. <laughs> no, you have to stop stealing and threatening people. It's dangerous. What if someone came after you? I'd beat him. 
<laughs> Even if there was a bear, I'd kill it with my bare hands. <laughs> Man, that that's impossible. I'll punch it real hard in the head like wham! <laughs> Dead. It's not that easy. You'll get mauled. Yeah, right. I'll dodge. <laughs> I bet I can kill two different bears at once. <laughs> Man, no. It's useless. I don't think Min's brain even knows what fear is. Jeez, Jun, you really sound like Noelle sometimes. Noelle is my best friend. She's the kid in class who goes, but wait, you forgot to collect our homework. I introduced Min to her a while back, but it was like hate at first sight. Oh. I think Min wants to kill her. Someday, when Dia decides she doesn't like Noelle anymore, I'll kill her. <laughs> I'll kill her to death. God damn. Don't do that. <laughs> Even though Noelle is taller than you, someday I'll be the tallest. I won't lose to her. What does that have to do with anything? Also, if I was peeling an orange for you, I'd make sure to get all the white stringy stuff off, too. I bet Noelle wouldn't do that. What, what the heck kind of scenario is this? Why would you guys even be peeling oranges for me? Just, just because. Eh, forget it. <laughs> okay, let's look at the, the woman again. I like these goofy kids. I also think it's really fun having this, like, it just sort of, um... God, what, what's this effect called? This, uh, this po uh, posterized, uh, like, just people. Just, mm -hmm, like, an actual mm -hmm, goddamn picture, but, mm -hmm. like, kind of photoshopped around a little bit. Right. I was tricked! <gasps> Wait. Oh, oh, no, no, oh about the dog and the... and the... And the baby. Yeah. Nothing really interesting is happening right now. Talk about baseball. Mm -hmm. I guess I'll check back later. Okay. Yeah, talk to Jin. Jin Seo. Uh, let's see here. Let's offer is, popcorn. Yeah. Dia holds out the popcorn bucket. Thanks. Jinseo took a single piece of popcorn. You can take more than that. Really? You're so nice. Jinseo took another single piece of popcorn. <laughs> is there something going on with Min? Like, did she do a felony? Are the police after her? Uh, not that I know of. Why? She's been acting kind of weird all day. It's like she's hiding something. Really? I haven't noticed anything odd. Huh. I guess if even Junsio isn't concerned, everything is fine. Whew. I can just enjoy the game without worrying now. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see here. There's the eat popcorn. <gasps> let's eat popcorn. Yeah, let's eat some popcorn. Dia eats some popcorn. 10 out of 10, would eat again. Wait, can I not eat more? Nope. You're done. Damn it. Talk to Min. Wait, I want, I want to see if anything else happens. The visiting team is pitching now. Hmm? Whoa. Some kid behind us is talking to his dad. Dad? Who's that? <laughs> it's Tim Wakefield. He's a knuckleball pitcher. It's always fun watching these guys. Knuckleballers are pretty rare. The movement on that pitch is nuts. Like a butterfly with hiccups. <laughs> There's my dad voice. Wow. Some people actually talk to their parents on purpose. Like, for fun. I can't even imagine it. Every time I talk to my parents, it somehow turns into a lecture about something I did wrong. Ooh. So I only talk to them now when I absolutely have to. How come they switched correct? <laughs> How come they switched catchers too? Because catching a knuckleball is really unpleasant and difficult. If you can do it reasonably well, no one does it really well. That one skill can keep you on the team. A lot of knuckleball pitchers end up having one catcher who specializes in catching that pitch just for them. They're called personal catchers. For instance, J.C. Martin always caught Hoyt Wilhelm's knuckleball. And Doug Mirabelli always catches Tim Wakefield and his knuckleball for the Red Sox. The two of them even get traded together as a set. Wow, that's actually really interesting. It's like a weird baseball marriage. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Dia, I have a great idea. Let's get baseball married. I should learn to throw a knuckleball and you can catch it for me. Wait, but didn't they just say it's really hard to catch? So what? You're like a baseball goddess. You're overestimating me. I'm not that great. I just got lucky that one time. You've gotten lucky so many times I don't even know which one you're talking about. 
No, you don't understand. All those were flukes. Girl. They just happened by chance. I don't have a special technique or anything. Your special technique is being you. Aw. You're the best. You're putting too much faith in me. I'm not that good. When you see what I'm really like, you'll be like, that's it. I'll never think that. Even if I could catch it, are you really willing to be a pitcher? Why not? The pitcher is the coolest. You're so brave. I hate pitching. Why? You get to stand on the mound and kick ass in front of everyone. That's exactly why. I don't want people watching every move I make. Especially if I'm the only girl. If I mess up, it'll look like all girls suck at baseball. Oh, dear, no. <laughs> then don't mess up. Mm, that's hard. It's a situation where you can't help but be scared. Anyway, I'll be there with you. Aww. If there's two of us, we both have to mess up for them to think that. <laughs> so don't give up. I won't give up if you don't give up. Mm, that's kind of comforting. I've always been alone out there. I'll be... Wait, wait. It'll be you and me against the world. Okay, let's do it. Cute. Speaking of... Min. Yeah? Uh, let's offer popper. Dia holds out the popcorn bucket. Thanks. Min happily grabs a fistful of popcorn and stuffs it into her mouth. Oh. <laughs> oh okay, I guess never mind. <laughs> let's look at the baseball again. Oh, okay. The batter hit the ball. It pops up foul. It's coming toward us. Dia catches the ball in the popcorn bucket. Whoa. I got so lucky. Yeah! <laughs> wow, Dia, that was so cool. You're so cool. Dia fishes the ball out of the half-emptied tub. I better give this to Jun or Min. My parents think I went to study at Noelle's house. It'd be too suspicious to bring a baseball back. Min sits back down. Apparently, she had gotten up at some point to jump around and scream. She still looks really odd. Thanks. Hmm? For what? Existing. Aw. Aw. Let's give her the ball. Let's no, we're gonna give eat, her the ball. We're gonna eat some popcorn first. There's barely any left. Most of it exploded out when the ball landed in the tub. Okay. Give her the ball! Min. Yeah? Give her the baseball. Dia holds the baseball out to Min. Can I really have it? I'll treasure it forever. If anyone else touches it, I'll kill them. Nice. That's way too extreme. It's a big deal, though. Now we'll have something to remember you by. Huh? What do you mean, remember me by? That makes it sound like I'm going to die or something. Jinseo looks alarmed by Dia's response. Did... Did Min not tell you? Hmm? <gasps> tell me what? Where... Shut the hell your mouth! What? What the heck? It's nothing! Fuck the shut up! Min gets up and runs for it. Man! I've got to go after her. <gasps> Dia chases Min up the steps and down the concourse they arrived through. Min! Dia grabs the back of Min's hoodie. Min loses her balance and face plants onto the carpet. Oh. Are you okay? We're moving away. <gasps> Where? To Florida. Tomorrow. Tomorrow? Oh, God. So sudden. It wasn't sudden. I've known for a long time. I tried everything to stop it. I even threatened dad with oh a knife. God. I can't believe it failed. Violence is always the answer. Uh, Florida. That's all the way across the country. There's nothing there except old people. No, alligators live there too. I saw an animal planet. So this is it? This is it. Sorry. But that's not fair. We can't even send letters because my parents hate you so much. I won't see you the rest of my life. Hey, just because I'm moving doesn't mean we'll never meet again. If I want to see you and you want to see me, eventually it'll end up happening again. Right? How do you know? I just know. 
That's not a reason. Then, because... <gasps> Suddenly, Min seizes Dia's arm. She looks like she's had an epiphany. If you say our names together, it sounds like... Diamond. What? Like... Dia Min. Dia Min. Diamond. See? I wonder if it's supposed to be Dia. It might... It, no. Oh. It's even more like if you say your name wrong. Like Dia instead, instead of, of Dia. Dia. Okay, good. We were doing it right. I'm not saying my name wrong just to make it sound like Diamond. But it's more equal like that. My name got cut in half to make it work, so I had to sacrifice something too. I already call you Min. No one says Dia. The substitute teacher does. The substitute teacher sucks. <laughs> How do you even think of this? I was checking if our names sounded like together. I was checking if our names sounded like anything good together, like baseball. <laughs> How could it possibly sound like baseball? Our parents wouldn't would have had to name this base and ball. I know, I know. But still, it's pretty cool that we match it all, right? <laughs> and it's even baseball related. The universe is saying we're meant to be together. <laughs> Whoa, I guess she's right. <laughs> We'll meet again no matter what. I'll bet you a hundred dollars. Wait, but how are you going to give me the one hundred dollars if you lose? Huh? I just will. No, but if you're able to meet me, that means you won the bet. What? Technically, I guess? <laughs> oh no, <laughs> man. There's nothing technical about it. You just straight up wouldn't pay me. Oh. There's a long silence. She still doesn't get it. Never mind. It's okay. Oh, in this <laughs> such this like sad, maybe beautiful moment, just like it's so cute though. Yeah, whatever. You know what I mean. The point is, this isn't the end. I won't give up if you don't give up. Okay? Okay. I won't give up if you don't give up. And if an alligator attacks you, go for the eyes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cute! Oh, five years later! I Ninth knew it! Grade. I knew there'd be a time skip. <laughs> we were way too young. <laughs> and that was the sound of Mal just being ecstatic about the next episode. So fucking ecstatic. And you should be ecstatic about the next episode. Wow, this sound is awful. And we're going to go out to the sound of this terrible alarm clock. So thanks everybody for watching the video. Hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed it. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.